Yo, what is up, bros? We are back with the front expanded mod and the NC Conquest. I didn't like how it ended. I couldn't wait to get back to this because we got absolutely demolished the last attempt. And the problem was, I think you will all agree with this. There just was not enough Mannsteins. We have one Mannstein. That's not enough Mannsteins. So what we needed to do to win that was bring along an additional two Mannsteins. Now, I know German Armor Doctrine would say you concentrate your Mannsteins in a single weak point. I'm going to disagree with German Armor Doctrine for, for a moment. I think each front needs a Mannstein. So we are going to take one of these Mannsteins and place them on the western front. We're going to take an additional Mannstein and put them on the southern front. That should get things done. As well as we have, um, we have a King Tiger here that we need to put the Panzer Ace Vidman on. We got a Guderian. This is going to be like, look, when I tried to do it with no generals, I did not know that it was a that it could get spammy, right? I thought basically I was going to go up against this army, maybe a few additional units. That's not how this mod works. Also, got, got to put down the Luftwaffe ground troops, controlled by Garing himself. And, with Black Forest alien technologies, the Germans were able to reanimate Ludendorff and Hindenburg. Which is amazing. I'll just reanimate any any soldiers lost, I guess. Also, Ready, Mackinson shows up. The problem with Mackinson is he's like a hundred years old. Um, so he can't really fight, but what he can do is is Ready, defend Germany by setting on Berlin and making sure there is good income. That's the job. Of Mackinson. So with that, let's begin Front's Extended Mod NC Conquest Take Two. I think the most important initial move, even more important than the dispersing of Munsteins across the front, is sending Goring to the Ukraine, where he will devour the entirety of of the Soviet's food supplies. We are going to use his appetite as a weapon of mass destruction. Now I know what you're saying. Not that much power should not be contained within one man's bowels. One sphincter should not hold that type of power. And I completely agree with you, but that's just the way it is. Some people some people are actually able to hold that much power. And it may not be fair. It may not even be right. But it's just how it is. Goring's bowels. Goring's sphincter could change the entire tide of this war. That's how important his bowels are. I think I did the best I could there. We're just going to have to throw a uh, paratroop unit down there. So, all right, this Manstein. Um, it'll probably be Balkan Manstein, really. I think Balkan Manstein is probably the best Manstein we can do. Or, you know, possibly save the Italians because we know they go down pretty easy as well, unfortunately. Unfortunately, but we we knew it was coming. We knew that would be the case. Again, guys, our curling pocket bros are again a priority. We will work on... There we go. Already on the move. And this time around... I think I'm going to attack less with my uh, meat shield. That'll at least have them holding up a little bit longer. 
I will pick and choose uh, which ones I think are good to tag with. But I'm not going to attack along the whole front. Commando units with generals definitely need to attack with him. Regular commando units, I think I'm going to hold off on. Let's see if Devers runs again like the coward he is. We all seen the cowardly act from last time. Nobody can deny the amount of coward that he showed last time. The spick. Oh! My God. That's not good. That's not a good look for the Western Front right there. It was all fun and games when I came into this with no generals. Remember how fun that was? Oh, that was that was fine. What about now? We need to do a little bit better job up here in the north. I kind of know what they do now. I should have known that from the beginning that they would crowd the Baltic Sea and start coming into Denmark and uh, Norway. I think we're good with that, right? Actually, we could pull him off. He can help defend. Mm. Yeah, I think we've done. I think that was the best possible start. As long as we can get Goring, his bowels, his sphincter, into the Ukraine. We can pull out this win easy. Week two, look at that. He may be too old to fight, but Mackinson brought in the dough. Well done, Mackinson. That is exactly what we were needing. We lost the econo economic battle last time. It, it wasn't even close. We should have been able to do a lot better and we just, we fell on every level. Already. Look, he did it again. He did it again. I actually, I thought he would be a little bit different. He ran and hit again. So, so disappointing. I don't know. Ha Hamburg. He, Goring won't move off a of Hamburg because he thought somebody said hamburgers. It's not hamburgers, Goring. This is already fairly different from our last attempt. That brutal, brutal last attempt. All right, now. Southern Mainstein getting involved. Almost got that. Oh, now... Look, this is not going to be a problem. Now we can't afford meat shield. Before, we, we just could not afford meat shield. That was the main problem. I, I would say this. There's a possibility that even without using all these generals. That if I had at least the money to place meat shield down. I could have easily... Defeated the Red Army. Easily. We gotta hurry up and get a lot of these cities taken on the front before the spam 
arrives. We gotta break the Soviet economy before they start spamming. Look at this. This is so. This is glorious. What? I need meat shield somewhere. I get to put meat shield. It feels. It just feels right. I'm just gonna hold this right here. I think. I could. Um. I could start placing. Yeah, you know what? I think I'll put uh, artillery up in here to help defend. Hold on. Did I move everybody? Besides Goring, who I can't get to leave, Hamburg. They didn't say hamburgers. Was hamburgers even a thing in Germany in 1945? These are the questions that I need answered. All right. I think that's good. Actually, hold on. I need... I need artillery up here. Alright, now we're good. Week three. Goring's bowels are growing weak. He needs to bust through here. I almost... <clears throat> I'm telling you. <clears throat> the weather changes here. They're messing with me. I didn't get a video up yesterday again because I had headaches. It happens every year. Boom! Hungry! Uh, goes down. Rip. Okay, um, they're already coming through here in the south. Everything's... Uh, they left the, their two cities open. Alright, let's pull you off. I don't know if you can help out. I don't... It looks like they could possibly... be out next round. Nice 600 bomb there. I would like to start moving up if I could. Remember, we got a little bit of movement forward last time. And then um, we were forced back pretty quickly. Oh, this guy. I didn't even notice he had went stupid. All right, well, you can't even attack, so why don't you go up here just for this round? Lay waste. We're trying not to let anybody land this time around. The generals especially. Last time, we weren't too good at that. We'd let, we'd let them land, and that was not, that was like the worst thing. But then again, again, guys, I didn't, I couldn't even defend. I had no money. But what, let's say this. What if I did concentrate my Mannsteins? What if I looked for the weak point on the Eastern Front and I concentrated my Mannsteins? Followed by Goring to, to clean up all rations left behind. Could I have already broken through? Uh, okay, hold on. This Goring needs to get off his ass, I think. Why don't you go... Why don't you go help out your Italian bros?
Uh, I think that's good. Let's get our meat shield out. There we go. I like what I'm seeing. I don't think the Italians are going to make it out of next round. Which makes me... I'm going to have to take this. Week four! Surprisingly! Oh, yeah! Nice! Well done, Italian bros! Uh, you know what? Here we go. Deavers! Deavers goes down. Big moment from the front. And now we're moving up. You know what? You're even going on the front. We need to close quickly. We can't sit there. Let them recapture these spots again. You gotta get the push. Come on, Southern Manstein. Oh, Southern Manstein. Oh my God. That is why you need a Southern Manstein. That is why you need to spread out your Manstein's. I stand... Oh my god. Oh, it's a... Holy god. What a... What, what a display of brutality. Of savagery. That was one of the most amazing... Mic drops. Oh, maybe you should have concentrated your Munsteins. No. Maybe you should have listened to me. You spread out the Munsteins. Someday people will start listening to me. Keep the Mansteins spread out. It's not that hard. This is an issue. All right. We need you up here. We got a... Rokosovsky with a lot of health. I mean, a lot of health for this mod, where you only do... Well, I don't know. The one bro did dropped a 900 bomb, but usually... I'm not seeing much damage over 100 to 200. Which would take us a while to take down Rokosovsky. And especially the incoming Stalin with 3,000. I want to put down more artillery, but we need to see... What we get covered with our meat shield. We got some openings to plug. But a lot. A lot better than last time. But I doubt we have any money left. Mackinson's 90 year old ass can only do so much.
Yeah, we're gonna have no money left. Um. I mean, we don't really need it here. We got those emplacements, but I'm gonna go ahead and go there. Oh, damn it! I didn't mean to do that. <sighs> All right, that looks a lot better than last time around. And don't you think for a moment that the Swiss are not going to feel the full fury of the three Monsteins. Week five. Stalin's probably gonna be in range by next week. We gotta keep an eye on that. Govorov trying to make it through. Pretty Walmart Govorov, though. I think we're... Oh, look at this. Why are you wasting my time? Fear's gonna go off right here. Look! He didn't want any part of the Manstein Guderian fear uh, threesome. Even the Gert Rosasovsky said that was too much. He he knew when he had been bested. Uh, yeah, move out. We're holding our own. If we could just get Goring and his sphincter to Kiev, I think the tide of war would swing to the Germans' favor, without a doubt. There's some things you just know. That's one of those things. God, this Manstein is an absolute savage. He doesn't he, he doesn't care. The man does not care. Although we did have a we had a slight breakthrough. We will retreat, reform, and we, we will do better next time. We need more people just going off, and we're not getting it. The Southern Meinstein is like the only one. And the Southern Meinstein can't do everything. You're asking a lot of Southern Manstein. We definitely did not make it that far last time around. We've made it further in the West than was ever possible the last time around. Get this area cleared out here. Even moving up a little bit. But I doubt we're just we're just making it like We don't have money to uh, put down artillery. A 
As long as we keep our generals in pretty good health, we got this. Our curling pocket bros are holding out in the sewers again. Just hold on, bros. We'll get there. End of round five is where we are going to put a wrap on this episode. We have done a far better job this time around, obviously, as you would think, with the addition of two extra Meinsteins and six other generals, including the Bowels of Goring. I'm saying we probably won't bust through the Eastern Front next episode, but I think we will be able to bust through in the Western Front. Something just tells me that. And, uh... We're probably going to have to have Manstein moving back and forth here. All he's, all he's really got to do is hold the Southern Front. We don't need him to advance necessarily. Just hold. All right, bros, with that, that's a wrap. If you are enjoying this content, you know what to do. Slap the like and subscribe at the notification bell, and I will speak here for our next upload. Peace. Bruminati, out.